Understanding trauma can change the way we see others and ourselves. The human brain is brilliantly wired for survival. It is its main job and it does it without any conscious thought. The reptilian brain keeps our hearts pumping and all our other systems functioning in beautiful harmony. The limbic system, our emotional center, instinctively reacts to threat and pleasure. The amygdala sounds the alarm when we perceive we are under threat. The neocortex, where logic and reason live, takes a back seat when danger strikes. When trauma happens, the survival brain takes over. Fight, flight or freeze kicks in. Adrenaline surges throughout our bodies and the hippocampus, which normally files our memories, stops doing that and instead floods us with cortisol numbing pain so we can evade whatever threat we perceive we are facing. But is there a cost? Memories can get stuck in the limbic system. We can experience triggers. Sounds, smells, phrases can launch the same threat response, sometimes even many years later. The body remembers what the brain can't process. Trauma symptoms include anxiety, overwhelming sadness, fear, anger, sleepless nights, or nothing at all. Sometimes we experience numbness or detachment, but often hyper-awareness or hyper-arousal. Some people may turn to alcohol or drugs to help cope with the symptoms they experience, whilst others may dissociate. No two responses are the same. We are all unique. Secondary trauma affects those who support others too. No one is immune from the impact of trauma. If someone seems distant or agitated, it could be a trauma response. Asking them a gentle question such as, have you eaten or would you like some water, can help ground them and reconnect with the here and now. Trauma is not a sign of weakness. It is the brain's way of protecting us. And understanding it helps us protect one another. For more information, get in touch with Trauma Informed Solutions, a J3MS consulting company.